All right, gang, welcome back for another Toy Show unboxing. Today we're going to open a Masters of the Universe Mattel Creations exclusive Extendar. Oh, so you get a good shot of that? I'm all flipping around willy-nilly. Ooh. Box art is always pretty cool. Yeah, it's always fantastic. What the fuck is this scuba-looking dude on the back? <coughs> <laughs> so, look at the front of that when you turn it around. Fucking freight center is behind him on the, on the back here. Eh. What's this? What when you time? turn it around, look at his face. Okay, what about it? Look at it. Like the, the, the part of the. Like the face guard. Yeah, it looks like it's cracked. Alright, so I'm not the only one who sees it. Oh, that's Scuba Dude. That's the dude with the wheel on his chest. I forget what the fuck his name is. Ow! The fuck. What is that guy's name? I don't know. Somebody don't comment know. that guy's name if they know it. I'm not going to look it up. I hope a brother out. All right, this is one of those friendly ones where we just go. Yeah, it's always a nice size. collectors, I'm not keeping it. Fuck it. Um, it's a comic book. And in the bag, actually, this is a comic book. Oh, uh, not a card? Yeah, not a card. Right, taking out that thing. Yeah, I think that is a crack. Weird. Is that what the thing people are bitching about? No, they've been bitching about them in a different spot. But that, I'm trying to see from the top. It's on the top. I can't really tell beyond that. It could also just be like the plastic, so you know what I mean, like because the plastic's not exactly like one consistent color, right? You know. Well, let's find out. All right, gang, we'll be right back. He-Man's rising force, Extendar. This goes mine. He's out of reach. I have power. Figures and sets full separately. You from the masters of the universe, Extendar, a tower of power. All right, gang, we're back. He's all geared up um, and extended out. <coughs> oh, he's cool. There wasn't like a crack. It. No, it's not a crack. It's weird. It's something in the paint, I guess, or whatever the fuck. It's cool if it looks like a crack. You but can't really make it out on camera, but it goes down this like face guard. Yeah, that's wild. He's cool though. Yeah, he is. The shield is fairly accurate to the old school one. It neither stays collapsed or uh, folded out. He ends up with more articulation than a t normal Masters figure just because of the swivels at the extensions. Yeah. It would be cool to get, like I said, off camera, it would be cool to get a couple of them and stretch them out even yeah. more. Yeah, he's pretty cool. I mean, I don't know, he's got decent he's all right articulation. I mean, for a Masters toy. No, I'm saying, though, he has more swivel joints in his yeah. arms, yeah. Yeah, no, he's got a fair amount of shit going on. And I should be able to take these off, right? These on? Or yeah. Right on? Yeah. Yeah. So I could put them down the like <coughs> And you him. absolutely could yeah. extend them, huh? So I could put them at the, like his regular. Yeah, regular size, which would probably put him at the same height as. I don't know. He's a pretty cool master figure. i give him like an eight. I'll give him a solid eight. Not necessarily anything wrong with him. Is just, you know, the kite shield is weird, but it's always yeah, been. Yeah, that's the. It's. I mean, it's accurate to what you know, the original. But like, you can't give him a fucking hammer. Like, paint me something red, like gold, like red, like that. What the fuck, like? He does no weapon. You know what? You know he what? Just has this? Like I don't like that. Makes no sense to me. You don't even have to retool. You do paint on it. Give me a fucking same color one as somebody. I don't give a shit. Somebody in the 
Masters of the WWE Universe line. I'm Can't, not penalizing for not having like something that doesn't have. Not what I'm getting at. But like, yeah, I'm cool on the towel. Something in the dub Masters of the WWE Universe line, somebody or something, maybe like one of the rings. Right. Came with like a red mace that's probably the same color as his shield. So you have that somewhere. You could give him that. Oh, yeah. Probably Hogan. No, I think it was the regular ring because I have it. Oh, okay. I mean, honestly, if you want, I'll give it to you. I'll give you one. Because I have one probably more handy than you do. True. You know what I mean, like, that's probably true. I have the thing. I don't know where the fuck it is. I don't yeah. know if those figures aren't, if I move them out of that or not. Yeah. But all in all, he's cool. Like, you can go with the, you know, he fit. He's, he's pretty cool. That's all I really got to say about it. He's neat. I like that he extends. He does his gimmick. The shield looks like an Adult Swim character. <laughs> <laughs> Put googly eyes on it? Yeah, dude. <laughs> Something out of the world of gumball. Made MC Chris the voice of it. <laughs> Look at it. wonder if any of those other parts fucking extend. <laughs> <laughs> he is a cool tool. I remember being all... Stoked when I got this one when I was a kid. I might have one somewhere. Possibly in that fucking dresser. He was cool back then. He was peak stupid bullshit He-Man guy. Yeah. Exactly. Like the rock ones. Are they making the second rock one? Because there was two rock people. What? Uh, I'm sure they will at some point. They're going to milk that. Why not just use the same, it's the same fucking... They'll use the same... Oh, what was his name? Standor? Or stu- now, Standor was the Stan Lee. It's, it's, it's fucking something. I thought the other rock one was a chick, but I could be mistaken. It was like 40 it's years rock ago. rock on and fucking something. Yeah. I don't, I don't know. I don't fuck like looking it up. I could. But whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll probably just fucking put it in the text across the screen somewhere. Right? Yeah, I'm waiting for, for you to like, wrap up this video. You've <laughs> right, been dude. rambling for like three minutes. All right, gang. If you like the videos, like and subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you, if you want to know when we post. And as always, thanks for watching Twitch Show Unboxing, and we'll see you next time.